This iPhone 13 Pro had an ocean adventure and came back more fried than a piece of calamari. Let's take a deep dive and see if this is a rescue mission or a lost cause. My first step is to take my DC power supply probes and touch them to the battery connector. And look at that amperage draw, that means we have mainline shorts. I need to remove the motherboard from the housing. There's one more screw holding it down and look how corroded it is. I'll have to go in there with some wire cutters to get it out. With the board out of the housing, I should remove this shield to get a look at some of the components. They look clean, but now I can measure my main line. With my board view software open, this is the area I just exposed and we can measure the line at this capacitor. I can use my multimeter to measure this capacitor at main and we can hear that it's beeping short, so this line is the problem. But the top of this board is pretty clean, so I'll have to split the layers to view the inner components. But nope, there doesn't seem to be corrosion on the inside either. It looks pretty clean here. I can track down a few more capacitors underneath this shield. And whoa, there we go. Looks like I found the Crest Station Clubhouse. Sorry for the bad pun. So let's clean this area up. With that a little cleaner, let's measure the main line again. Still short, and I bet this bad boy is the last cause here. Pop it out, and one more measure, and we are clear. This IC has to do with USB accessories like lightning to HDMI or lightning to ethernet, but this is a data recovery case and that's not important here. So for this case, I'll leave it off. The only things I need for data is a charge port, a battery, and a screen, so let's see if it turns on. And alright, I have an Apple logo. My customer will be happy to get their pictures back. There we go. If you need data recovery, the link's in the description. Thanks for watching.